Here we go. Continue on. I'll be back. The problem with two gigabyte memory cards on a camera that only supports two gigabyte memory cards. Oh, I'm sorry. Is it my turn now? <laughs> okay. For 25 minutes, we're hearing that sound. Finally, the doctor walks out. He goes, we have two issues. Uh, one, we figured out what's going on. Um, did somebody play a practical joke on you guys last night? Because we may have to check you guys, too. And we're all going, no, 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 no. The second one, um, we have retrieved the item, but we don't know what it is. Items, plural. <laughs> I know you're into some stuff, man, but I don't know what. Go on, man. And we, we are explained what is going on. Everyone else is going like this. I'm doing this. <laughs> Which in turn is this response. <laughs> I'm over here going. <laughs> Are you sure what you do? Give me a goddamn thing. <laughs> Fucking swear. <laughs> to, to what? Swear in the Bible. No. <laughs> Why? No. Did you do it? Did you do it? No. Did you do it? Maybe. <laughs> what did you do? Pray. So I explained to him what I did and why I did it. I got one person that says, that's why I fell asleep first, and the rest of them all went, oh. <laughs> At the end of the convention, he was released from the hospital, and the doctor sent him home with a keepsake. <laughs> <laughs> Fully inflated. The green ones apparently do not get to be that big. The green ones apparently be about that big. Oh. And they sent it home to him in a jar. <laughs> to which now it goes to uh, Anthrocon. If you ever go to Anthrocon and you see an individual walking around dressed as a gray wolf with a chain around his waist with a jar tied to that chain, look up, I walk up to him and go, hi Jack, and walk up. He will go. <laughs> and I'm okay with it. I told this joke to Kiefer. I told this story to Kiefer. And every bit of it is unfortunately true. <laughs> Kiefer now refuses to fall asleep around me. <laughs> because Kiefer snores. <laughs> and every last year, I had just got done doing my show, and Kiefer is, uh, he's being Kiefer. He is, I've done all my stuff for the day, and I'm going to, hey, look, a couch in the lobby. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'd walk in. I sit down, right next to him. And somebody goes, hi, Tracer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> What's the matter? I can't even sleep around you anymore. So, so I want you to look at that little earplug in your hand. Like that. And I'm serious. Make sure he gets it. Because for the next every con that he attends, I'm going to make sure that somebody is there to give him earplugs. Please feel free to capitulate this joke. <laughs> I want to see the look on his face, or at least description of looks on his face. It's like I've never seen a, uh, a man that a man that age's face melt that quickly. Oh. 
<laughs> so, all right. Um, I, I've got to ask. This happened before or after the cancer business diagnosis. Okay, that that uh, that was actually after. Uh, that was about three months after. Okay, it was. Okay, well I've got money to spend. <laughs> Well, there, was the, there was the karma theory. So. Uh, no, uh, well, the karma theory. If if karma applies to me, I'm fucked. So <laughs> aren't we all? Hi, I'm and uh, no, and that explains karma, everything. Doesn't, karma doesn't apply to me. It, it's one of those. Hey, furries, we're immune to karma. I want you to know that right now. We're we're all immune to karma. As long as we're in this room. Walk out of there, you're screwed. <laughs> <laughs> so, <coughs> I, I was asked uh, a little while back because I used to attend cons with a, a young lady. Uh, I was at one point married. What happened? Sorry. I tried doing the straight thing and really didn't fuck with <laughs> So. She liked dick, so did I. It just didn't work out. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> so, <coughs> I, I have a. I actually have something that I'm going to go over. Mostly for the fact that I'm too stupid to remember it. Hey there, no. Okay. Hey there, just load it. Uh, I'm cheating. Today is my I'm using notes. This is my new day. Doesn't <laughs> <laughs> like you. Telephone. I blame. Yeah. Um, I, I blame telephone. That's, that's how it's working. Yeah, okay. So, you know, I, 
That was You're really good. Help. Seriously, have you ever just stopped? Okay, why not? Yes. Okay, please. Like I said, I tried the straight thing. Didn't work. I just, no, my, like my ex-wife. I couldn't really ask her to do anything. Now, I asked her to take the car one time to get an oil change. Uh, she came back with a $700 repair bill for a partial rebuild. And she looks at me and she says, you know, when I got tears in her eyes, I'm thinking she knows she spent a lot of money. She, she knows she spent too much money. But she's got tears in her eyes and she's glaring at me like, I will burn your soul to the very depths of hell. That look. Any guy who's ever been in a relationship with a woman knows this look. Any woman who's ever been in a relationship with a woman knows this look. I like how you raised your hand on the second one. You go, yeah! No, 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 no. She's staring at me. I'm covering her for you. Keep don't you fucking dare. That look, that look, that look. Don't you fucking say a goddamn word. Don't agree with him. Don't you fuck. You like the pussy? Never happen again. <laughs> That's what that breaks down to. But she's got this look in her eye like, you're a dead man. I'm looking at her doing, she's crying, you know. I'm trying to do the nice thing, the sensible thing, the sensitive thing. You know, the thing a lot of women bitch about but never actually want, they want the guy to go, fuck it, whatever. Instead, they all say that they want the guy to go, I'm sorry, honey, what can I do? So I tried the, I'm sorry, honey, what's wrong? And she, you know, I got there. They told me I had no blinker fluid. <coughs> How long have I been driving around with no blinker fluid? Is it your fucking plan? You want me to die? You want me to die in a car wreck because of no fucking blinker fluid? I've been driving around. How long with no blinker fluid? I'm going. <coughs> this is every guy's look in that moment. <laughs> it's that deer in the headlight. I'm fucked. I don't know how to get out of this. <coughs> But I'm fucked. And you know, guys, if, if you really want to impress a woman, I'm serious. If you really want to impress a woman, learn how to order her favorite drink. My, my wife, my ex-wife and I, we went to Starbucks. And the men will understand this. If you pull up, <clears throat> and I think you ordered uh, OT, warm, Two sugars, we'll lick it. <coughs> Real pretty simple. My wife. Okay, okay, okay. Um, are you listening? All right, okay. You're listening, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll have a double mocha, uh, mocha vanilla with a espresso double shot, uh, foam half lip, whip soy, uh, whip soy, no what? Uh, hmm. Whip soy, uh, double cup, no cup. At least that's what I think she said. I, 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 I just kind of like the guy like, tell me about that. Please. <coughs> so I'd I like to change my order. I'm going to change your order too. I like a whiskey. I, I just want a big ass cup of whiskey because later I'm going to drive off a cliff. I don't want to feel it. <coughs> This one's gonna get some groans. And I say this because it's fucking true. All of the groans. How do I like groans? Because it gives me an excuse to drink. Welcome to my show. Um, but honestly, it's. You know, guys, seriously, be wary of your woman. If we're here straight. Oh, no, he's like reluctant. Wow. <laughs> That's the highest percentage I've ever seen. Hey, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> because you, well, the first time you always know you're straight. Because when you ask that question, the hands are very reluctant. <laughs> <laughs> <Is> that? <laughs> do I say yes and get ousted from the crowd, or do I say no and be like, no, <laughs> you've got me on gay ground? But you know, it's you guys, uh, be wary of your woman. 
because at a moment's notice they will turn on you. At one moment, because here's the relationship, the typical female-male relationship. Actually, the typical Emmy relationship. There's three stages. I love you. I love you more. No, I love you more. It's so fucking huge that you're going to get diabetes. You know? <laughs> it's so fucking sweet that you're going to go, I'm going to vomit. Like watch your telephone. <laughs> oh my god, she gives me to be. <laughs> exactly. So it's, but it's one of those, okay, there's that. Then you've got the relationship. Here's the part of the relationship where a lot of, wow, where a lot of, a lot of relationships hit this point and they recover. They really do. But they hit this point of, how are you doing? What are you doing today? Not much. It becomes actual conversation. Instead of the, let's annoy every motherfucker on the planet with how cute we're going to try and be. <laughs> <coughs> because I don't care if you're both 600 pounds, if you're going, I love you too, I love you, I love cheeseburgers. What? I mean, I love you too. <laughs> People in the room are going to go, it's so cute. I'm glad they found some more. That's a typical human response. But on the third stage, you get fuck you, you get fuck you, you fuck you, and they're yelling, disturbs my plane, Duke Nukem, that's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> so I've had people ask me, you know, are you, are you in support of gay marriage? And I went, really? I wouldn't want to marry me. <laughs> Why would I want other, other people to marry me? Much less, okay, I will support marriage. What about gay marriage? I don't believe in it. It doesn't exist. It's marriage, period. That's all it is. Yeah. It's, it's marriage, period. It's, it's not who, it, it's not a man or woman that you love. <gasps> sure. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Did you bring it up for the whole class? <laughs> I, I will give you alcohol. Don't mess with beer cat. He won't hurt you. I will give you <laughs> alcohol. I don't drink. Uh, no, 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 I know. I will give you alcohol. Uh, It'll be even, even, even trade. Once this is empty, you will get yours back. No, no, no. I, I'm actually still full from earlier, so I very much appreciate it. But no, it's. I don't, I'm, um, and now it has become Sherping 101. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, welcome to my panel. I'm Tracer. Hi, Hi. 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 And eventually... No. Damn it. I would have whacked my ass off had that been telephone. That would have been perfect. <laughs> <laughs> it's just me. <sighs> but anyway, it's, it, it breaks down to, you know, it's not a man or a woman that you love. It's a person. Here, here. So it's when I hear people say gay marriage, I kind of laugh. There's no such thing. <laughs> well, when I happy marriage. No, when I, when I drive down the road, the old term of it. Yeah. I don't gay drive. <laughs> <laughs> when I call somebody on the phone, I don't gay call somebody on the phone. When I call somebody on Facebook, I don't gay poke the. Right, that's a bad one. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, in no deal, it's. A man or a woman, or a man and a man, or a woman and a woman. It's not the sex that matters, it's the person, period. So all of the Republicans, and even the Democrats, or the liberals, or the Orthodox Christians, I call them Orthodox Christians because they believe in what their church has taught them instead of what their Bible has taught them. <laughs> Well, let's, start with an easy one. That. Well, let's start with an easy one. What the Bible has taught them. Thou shalt not judge. Motherfuckers, why do you feel the, uh, feel the right to biblically, uh, to micromanage the biblical Lord and Savior? You have no place. Thank Here's you. Here's an If I die and go up or down, I'm going to be judged by him. Period. End of story. Not by this guy who thought I was a douchebag going to high school. Not by this guy who thought I was a douchebag going to college. Not by this guy who thought I was a douchebag going to graduate school. I've really been a douchebag in my life. <laughs> so, and well, you know, there's no such thing as gay marriage. So when somebody says, you know, are you in support of gay marriage? I say no. Thank you heavily, by the way, for the biblical comment oh, there. Right. I have wanted to say that 
Well, you're some of my friends. How is this? Love thy neighbor. 